you have any plans to visit the border? I, at some point, you know, I, we've been to the border. You haven't been to the border. I, and I haven't been to Europe. And I mean, I don't, I don't understand the point that you're making. What an embarrassment. I haven't been to Europe. Are you kidding me? What does that have to do with anything? The vice president being ripped for this tone deaf reaction to the growing crisis. Do you plan to visit the border? Uh, um, not today. <laughs> He's a very unserious person about an incredibly uh, serious crisis. The White House has no idea what borders are. Kamala Harris is doing about the migrant surge. When are you going to the border, the Vice President? The administration has asked. I'm not finished. <laughs> I've said I'm going to the border. Kamala Harris has been put in charge of trying to figure out the root causes, why all those people from Central America come here. In 2017, she tweeted, say it loud, say it clear, everyone is welcome here. She was given this job, she doesn't take it seriously. Overall, we are seeing progress. Like in Riley, her accused killer came to the U.S. illegally. He is in the country illegally when he murdered that officer. The illegal immigrant now accused of killing a mother and son while driving drunk. An undocumented immigrant convicted of rape. An 18-year-old illegal immigrant on a rape charge in Hicksville, Ohio. Officials in Texas have seized more than 400 million doses of fentanyl. Still no plans for Vice President Kamala Harris to go visit the border. I've been to the border before. I will go again. She hasn't been as Vice President, though. She's pandering to her open border base. That's what this administration does. It is ridiculous. Obviously, it is embarrassing for America that this is our Vice President.